In the county of Somerset, there once lived a squire by the name of Allworthy. Alas, his young wife died, leaving the good gentleman in possession of a considerable fortune, but with no family to inherit it. Every night at exactly the same hour, my brother would turn to me and say, uh, Sister, my dear wife has gone on a journey only a little before me, and sooner or later I'll catch up with her and we'll never, never be, be part parted again. Yes, dear brother. My brother. So, here it was. Brother and sister living out their lives in dull monotony to leave nothing but a stone plaque above a hospital door. However, one winter's evening, not long after the squire returned from three months' business in London, all this changed forever. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom. Gracious, it's a child! Uh, uh, Mrs. Wilkins, come here quickly! Lord, sir, I have never seen a man without his coat on before. Uh, uh, Mrs. Wilkins, what's to be done? Done, sir? Uh, about this? This, sir? About this child, it's Mrs. A Wilkins. Boy, sir. I can see that. How did it get here? I hardly know, sir. Brother, what is all this shouting? Uh, 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 sister, I have something to show you. Well, what is it? Well, look for yourself. Well, who can its mother be? How could the hussy do such a thing? Oh, the poor thing. For pity's sake, what has brought you to our What door? wickedness indeed. Oh, the darling innocent child. Which heart? Bless the child. The vile slut. Mrs. Wilkins. Well? Well, what, brother? Well, well, what's to be done? What's to be done? Well, we, you must do something. Well, oh. I do. How it stinks. It doesn't smell like a Christian. Dolly, discover the mother. Have the slut whipped. That, 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 that will do, Mrs. Wilkins. I'm sure the poor mother only took this action to provide for her poor child. Tongues will wag. This is what happens when whores lay their sins at an honest man's that, that, that door. Things could have turned out far more worse for the poor child. If I might make a suggestion, sir, put it in a basket, lay it on the church step. It is a cold night and the child may not live until morning. But we will have done our Christian duty. Uh, uh, Mrs. Wilkins, we will do no such thing. Now, go find the mother. And sister, you seem to have developed a, a great fondness for the poor infant already. What's, what's that they're saying there? She says the mother is Jones, sir. Jenny Jones. Jones has been taken to wearing silk to church. Mm. What will she think of next? Better for us all that she crawls away into a barn and hangs herself. Slut. Slut. Jones? <laughs> Jenny? Yes. Jenny Jones. Uh, very well, Mrs. Wilkins. Uh, send for Jenny Jones in the morning, please. And so Jenny was brought before the good squire the very next morning. You know, my child, reputations are so casually destroyed in the countryside that since you will not name the father, I have no option but to send you away. I shall send you to a place where you're unknown for your own good. I beg your honour, believe me when I say that I am bound by a solemn oath not to reveal the baby's father, but someday it shall be known to you. I promise you, I, sir. I, 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 I respect that, Jenny, but uh, you must go now and be a good girl for the rest of your days. Believe me, there is more pleasure in a life of virtue than a life spent in debauchery. Now, this is uh, for your instruction, and this is for your, your journey. And as for the child, I shall provide for it in a far better manner than you could ever expect. I shall adopt him for my own. Thank you for your kindness, sir. May I see the little boy before I leave? Yes, yes. Bless you, sir. <sighs> oh! oh. <laughs> 
Bridget <laughs> and Mrs. Wilkins. I've decided to adopt the child. I shall name him after myself. He shall be called Thomas. Oh, brother, and he is such a sweet child after all. And so the baby was adopted and cared for by the squire and Bridget as if he were their own. And in due time, the child was christened and given the name Tom Jones. Tom, Tom Jones! Jones.